So on display list, we are passing title. So rather than passing the title, now we can start passing to do. And on display item, we can, from props, we should accept to do. And we can do where title is equal to to do dot title. So right now the state checked depends on this dot state dot done. So instead of that, it should depend on to do dot done, whether to do is done or not. So right now the handle done function is available at a display item level. We need to move it to the app level. So just like here handle delete, what we can do is we can do handle handle done. So handle done can do the same thing. Title to be marked as done. And we can do console log. wants to be marked as done and and if we go down and we can do when we are calling display list there we can call handle done is equal to this dot handle done and we can come back to the display item level and here we no longer need handle done so we can delete it and now we can change the function that is fired on on change so instead of having this dot handle done we can do this dot props dot handle done and bind null comma title and let's go to display item and in the display item just like handle delete we can do handle done is equal to this dot props dot handle done. In app.js we added the method handle done but we didn't finish it. So let's try to finish this method handle done. So here what we have is var underscore to do's. So underscore to do's is this dot state dot to do's. So this is the current state of to do's. From this to do's, we have to find our to do. So var to do is equal to underscore to do's dot filter. And remember, the filter will return the result. So we need to get the first item. Now let's go inside filter. So inside filter, it will accept argument to do. And then we have this function. So let's try to implement that function. So here we'll do return to do dot title when return title is matching with title to be marked as done so now that we have new to do we need to flip the state of to do so how do we flip the state to do dot done is equal to reverse of to do dot done and since we have flipped the state state of this to do we can do this dot set state to do's new to do's so th the thing to notice here is that we are not setting the state of to do because at the app level we the state is only of title and to do's so from the to-dos, we cut our right to-do and we change the value of the to-do itself. So if you go back to our app and at the bottom, oops, the here handle, here handle done, we can see that here we did not do the proper binding. So handle this needs to be done here. And also as part of the cleanup, we can go to display item and we need to remove the constructor because it is no longer being used. Now let's give it a try. If we some mark something as done, it is done. 
you mark something as done so this thing so these items are marked as done but we are not changing the return value now let's see what is the reason for that so our code here is this dot state dot to do's filter but we are not doing any return here so it, you know, the return is missing so let's add return and let's do a full refresh when i and now you can see the value changing here if i mark something as done it is done if i marked as undone it is undone and we are able to delete and we are also able to add an item and when we add an item the number is incremented here and then we can mark this as done so it looks like everything is working properly